Hey everybody, today I am chatting a little bit about the 16-8 program. It's kind of buzz right now and we've got some groups going and I just wanted to explain it on this video so I could just pass that around. So this program is not new, but I have personally been trying it for about the last six months. So it was new to me, um, opposed to like cleansing weekly or every other week, a full 24 or 48 hours, I have gone to the 16-8 program and I tell you it, the shift um, was amazing and I wasn't expecting it. So it could partially be at this stage of my life or, you know, just shaking things up, that sort of thing. But it's so simple, which is amazing. And it's just a shift of when you eat 16 hours fasting, eight hours of eating every day. And you have to be pretty strict on that. I mean, of course, there's going to be days when you can't do that. But for the most part, I can do this very, very easily. So hopefully you can see this. Um, First thing in the morning, whenever I wake up, I do my ionic. And then um, a little bit later, usually when I get here to the mat, I do my cleanse. And then between that time and when I'm done here, which is usually around 11 to 12 o'clock, um, I will only have water, tea. If you're a coffee drinker, then um, low acidic coffee. Isogenics has one, there's probably some others out there. Bone broth, Bia, E-Shots. Those are the things I would be consuming in that time, lots of water. Now, I will finish my um, morning practice and I will have my first shake around 11 or 12 o'clock. Then I'll do another shake around two to three. You can have a snack in between there. I am not hungry in between there because that's a lot of food that I'm consuming within an eight hour window. And then I have dinner and then after dinner I try to consume again just these things. Water, tea, um, bone broth is nice in the winter. Um, I don't do BRE shots in the evening because they've got some caffeine in them and that'll get you going so that you can get at least seven hours of sleep. It's that easy. You just repeat it every day. So basically, I'm just not eating breakfast. I'm just going to have liquids during that time. I find some people are like, well, why do you do the cleanse? I feel like the cleanse gives me just a little bit of a boost um, so that I have um, enough energy to make it through my two hours of practice typically is what I do every morning. So um, that is why I do that. Plus it's a nice gentle little detox. Um, of course the aloe vera and all of those wonderful things that are in the cleanse are just cleansing your system and especially while you're empty. So in the morning I haven't eaten for, you know, about 10 hours and then I put the cleanse in and it just cleans that all out, helps me with my joints and um, feeling bendy, all of that. So that's the system, it's so easy. Um, do you have to do the ionic and the cleanse? No, it's just maybe a shift of where you put your food in. But I feel like the ionic is um, a game changer for me as far as leveling out cravings, all of that. And we can chat more about that another time. But this is just um, to give you the information on how to do this 16-8 program, how simple it is. Um, and it's a matter of getting all of your calories. So you should know your macros. If you don't know your macros, then reach out to me or someone who can help you with that. And so I, I know that I need 105 grams of protein every day at least, and I need to do that within 1,700 calories. Those are my two numbers that I focus on. 1,700 calories, 105 grams of protein. When I hit those numbers, everything's good. Fired up in my brain, I feel good, I sleep good, I continue to um, maintain or even lose body fat and gain muscle mass. And that's my goal always. <laughs> All right. So there you have it. Intermittent fasting. It works. Give it a go.